Today I want to show you guys the difference between a high value man and a low value man in this episode of Pop the Balloon or Find Love episode 11 and I'm going to go ahead and start with the low value man and I'm going to explain why I think he's a low value man but I'm just pointing out the uh, errors that I think he should fix or maybe you guys should learn from so that you don't get to be shitted on every time by women but anyway let me go ahead and play the clip and then from there i'll summarize on why i think he's a low value man all right check it out guys all right let's go ahead and bring out our next single guy hello welcome in i'll have you take that what's your name my name is chandler chandler yes okay and chandler how old are you 28 28 and what do you do i'm a um fraud analyst so i just look at customers accounts make sure that their um fraudulent use of uh their account number just pay them back if it's a, a fraud case if not i just deny the claim off the evidence i found okay pretty cool yeah and now uh, what are some things you look for in a woman yeah um just uh kind of like my other half you know what i mean someone that compliments me someone that's a. Uh, you know, by my side, definitely uh, loves me for just me, you know? Okay, that's yeah. nice. Yeah. Now, what are some of your deal breakers? Uh, definitely, like, kids with multiple men. Mm. Um, and just uh, close-mindedness, you know, okay. not willing to just try new things and, you know, just be spontaneous. Okay. Yeah. All right. So we did get a couple of pop balloons. Of course. Let's go over to just a few of these ladies, see why they ended up popping their balloons. Sure. Of course. Okay. Of course. Start over here. Of course. <laughs> we can have your name and age and why you ended up popping. My name is Kayla. I'm 23. Hi. Um, I just popped it just because I don't like your outfit. Sure. I like your face. I like your height. I like everything about you. Like, if you had something different, I would definitely like. You like pick me. So, but, yeah. My next question for you is what what kind of outfit would you expect me to like wear? What what, what would you Not wear? a flannel cuz it's hot as shit outside definitely, and then definitely, um definitely, definitely. Other than that, maybe if you would have just took oh, anime. Not that either. Mm, you, Pokemon so that's or a deal I think that's, No, I don't know. It's just childish, but if you would have probably childish. took the flannel off, maybe. Sure. It would have gave a little bit more, but you making me hot standing in front of me, sure, so yeah. Sure, sure, sure. But that's it. No worries. And your name's Chandler. Yeah. It's so like interesting. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But yeah, that's it. No worries. Okay. Thank you. I would have, yeah. Thank you. You're welcome. Now, is Kayla someone that's your type? Yeah, actually. Yeah, I like the braids. Um, very beautiful. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah, tattoos are cool. Thank you. She's definitely someone I would approach. Okay. Yeah. All right, cool. Let's go over to another lady. Sure. We're going to skip around. If we can have your name and age and why you ended up popping. I'm Lex. I'm 23. Lex. And you're just not my type. No worries. Like, your whole aesthetic is just not, it doesn't fit me. Sure. No so, worries. Yeah, that's pretty much it. That's cool. Okay. All right. And now is Lex someone that you would approach? Yeah, no, she's beautiful. Yeah. Thank you. Love the hairstyle, love the dress. Tattoos are cool. Yeah, everything's cool. Yeah, Thank she's you. cool. Yeah, okay, definitely. Right, cool. Thank you, Lex. And we did get one down here as yes, well. Let's yes. go over here. Hi. <laughs> if we can have your name and age and why you ended up popping. Hi, um, my name is Dara. I'm 22 years of age. Yeah. And um, I just popped because um, even though I, do, I don't really know you, but um, based off of physical attraction, I'm not necessarily attracted. Totally. But that's really it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. No, I respect I love it. your freckles. Thank I love your freckles. You. <laughs> yeah, 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 you're oh, really okay. handsome. Thank you. Sure. I appreciate that. Yeah, sure. Thank mm -hmm. you. Now, is she also someone that you would approach? Oh, yeah, definitely. Mm -hmm. Eyes are beautiful. Hair Thank is you. great. Dress is great. Thank you. Yeah, she's super beautiful. Definitely. Thank you. Definitely. Okay. Let's go over here. If yes. we can have your name and age and why you ended up popping. Um, I'm Jazz, I'm 26. Um, I pop really because I feel like we would be more friends. Um, I'm a very like, not aggressive, but I'm a very dominant person and I just can't see you being overly dominant over me. So I just feel like we would be better as friends. Interesting, interesting. Okay, so you feel that I would not be the dominant one. I just feel like you'd be passive and I don't, not like there's nothing wrong with that. That's yeah. just, you know, I just feel, which is fine if you're passive, just yeah. not for me. Interesting, okay. 
no worries. Uh, but I you're feel, cool. Like, not, not, yeah, nothing no, else. No, I totally understand. Thank you. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you. All right. And now, is Jasmine someone that's your type? Yeah, she's beautiful. Love the braids, love the outfit. Everything's cool. You know what I'm saying? Real stylish. She's cool. Yeah, definitely, definitely. Thank you. Someone <laughs> like the outfit, okay? Yeah. <laughs> All right. Let's go on over here. Yes. We can have your name and age and why you ended up popping. I'm Brianna. I'm 26. Yeah. You know, my typical <laughs> my typical physical attraction is like a dark skin, so Totally. You know, you pretty light. You light bright. Yeah. Okay. You're not ugly though. Yeah. Now I've uh I've I've kinda like seen this before and I've just always wanted to ask what what is like your negative or what is your sort of like issue not necessarily issue but what is your like i guess for a lack of better words what is your beef if you will with light-skinned individuals do you I don't necessarily have a beef at all yeah, yeah. You just i'm necessarily... just more so attracted to dark skin like dark skin. that's exactly. just you know chocolate Ooh. okay you feel me it make you melt okay so that's just it um other than that like you're not you know you're cute yeah but I just prefer just a little bit darker. Chocolate, if I was, a yeah. dark skin. Okay, for sure, for sure. I, I it compliments like. me, you know. Interesting. It compliments okay. my skin tone. Okay, yeah, but, I feel that. Yeah. I feel that. Okay. Um, I don't have a beef. I like that. I like that. Reasonable answer. Thank you. Yeah. Thank you. Definitely. And that was uh, Brianna. Someone that's your type. Yeah, of course. Yeah, yeah. Beautiful. Love the earrings. Love the hair. The dress is awesome. Heels are great. Everything looks cool. It. Yeah. No, you're great. Okay. Thank you. Two more ladies up here. Of course, of course. If we can have your name and age and why you ended up popping. My name is Jacqueline. I'm 25. Jacqueline, hello. I ended up popping because I feel like we're not aesthetically compatible. Sure. Like, I'm not really feeling your shirt. Sure. Or like the rips in your pants. Sure. But I no think worries. you are very handsome in the no face. Worries. Now, is it like a past experience you've had with guys that dress like me? Or is it just like, mm, not really feeling the style? No, not a past experience. I'm just not feeling the style. Of course, of course. Mm -hmm. I appreciate that. Thank you. You're welcome. <laughs> and now, same thing. Is she someone that is she yeah, beautiful, type? Beautiful, beautiful. Love the hair. Earrings look great. Dress is cool. You know what I'm saying? Accessorizing <laughs> well. Heels look cool. Yeah, everything's cool. Yeah, Thank I like you. it. I like it. <laughs> Thank you. You're right. welcome. Okay, at your name, age, and why you ended up popping. Hi, I am Esther. I am Esther. 23. 23, cool. I have some reasons for you. You're yeah, ready for them? Okay, yeah. so. I like that you find beauty in everyone. Yeah. All the ladies here are gorgeous. I appreciate that. Definitely. But I feel like you should know exactly what you want. Oh, I do. Trust me. Okay. All right. No, that's locked good. in. Trust me. I All already right. know. Because she did ask, like, is she your type? And you kept saying yes and yes and yes. And there's nothing wrong with that. No, I love chocolate. You know what I'm saying? Okay, you know a bunch what? of beautiful black women here. I'll take so. it back then. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> trust me. Second reason, if I could just take the shoes, I'll take the shoes, right? Mm -hmm. And then just strip all of that. Keep the face. You're handsome. Wait, so you don't like the sneakers? No, I like the sneakers. Okay. Like this, gone. Oh, okay. So the rest <laughs> the of outfit, the, the clothes. Yeah, the outfit. Okay. Which, honestly, it's something that you can change. Yeah. I get that. Without a doubt. As well. Yeah. But it's just like, you know, you kind of knew what we were going to look like. Okay, so this like is my next goes. question. This yes. is my next question because I've seen a few of these videos. Okay. And a lot of women have, like, straight up flamed men off, like, wearing suits off wearing like what they're comfortable with I so you that. tell me like what what do you want your man to like how do you want your man to dress how do you want your man to look would you dress like this on the first date with me yes this is what i'm comfortable with okay. this is who i am hey i love that i respect yeah. that it's just if like you uh, you dress like that on the first date i would probably walk out. so then my next question is how do you want your man to dress on the first date Bring back that dark skin man that his so outfit. The dude with the with the open oh, yeah, yeah. yeah my brother yeah yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. well your brother you yeah, yeah. learn a few things got it for but sure. yeah Oops. other than that i mean you're handsome your answers have been great your questions have been great i like your face like i said it's just the outfit besides that maybe who knows <laughs> copy gotcha yeah. okay. thank you yeah thank you thank you yeah. and now is she someone that is your type yeah of course yeah, yeah i love beautiful black women you know i mean dress is fantastic everything's on point so i have no problem with this yeah she's great very cool thank you cool. we did get one down here awesome. yeah. <laughs> 
Hello, Hi. if we can What's have that? your name and age and why you ended up popping. Hi, I'm Karma. I'm 24. Karma. Um, actually, you are my type and you're somebody I'll be interested in. Yes. Now, when you said that you would wear that for a first date, I'm not opposed, but I do feel like people should dress up for first dates. Okay. You know, women, we got to do a little bit more. I feel like the man should be able to subside. Okay. Now, for me, it is personally like I had questions, but like yeah. I just felt like if I wasn't going to personally go on a date with you or match further, that's stuff that we can still talk about as friends, but it just wouldn't be somebody that I would look for as a partner with you right now. Sure, sure. But otherwise, you're a great person. You seem cool. Thank you. Seem interesting. Yeah, you got some cool stuff on. Respect the answer. Nice, nice. That was well spoken. Yeah, thank you. Yeah. Thank you. All right, and I feel like I know the answer to this, but is she your type? Man, chocolate. Yeah. You already know. Yeah. <laughs> come on now. Like, come on now. Dress is cool. Like, everything's good. Hair's on point. Yeah. yeah. I like thank the little, you. like, Nose ring kind of thing, yeah. It's different, yeah. Thank I like you, that. thank I like you. That. Yeah, no, I found him interesting. I probably just need to know you more, but otherwise, um, I just felt like I was going more off the outfit and off of just seeing myself with you. But yeah, you seem like a great person, though. Totally, totally. Cool. Thank you. Right. Thank you too. Thank you. So we do have an unpuffed balloon here. Yeah, definitely, definitely. If we can have your name and age. Hi, my name is Mishnah. I'm 23. Okay. And Mishnah, why do you still have your balloon unpuffed? Well. With all of my fellow colleagues, they had a lot of good points, mm. but I feel like when it comes to your outfit, you could always change your clothes. Yeah. And and I feel like when she was talking about anime, I'm a big anime nerd. Perfect. And she was saying, oh, anime is childish. So I'm like, that's what I'm looking for. That's what I'm looking for. Watch yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Yes. But I did. Yeah. I just felt like you seem like a really cool individual. You seem really la laid back. And yeah. the way you were. Um, responding to the other ladies answers it wasn't defensive it wasn't yeah. like well I'm, i know i'm good looking yeah. like but you seem to very nice yeah. you seem very nice thank you okay. thank you and i'm looking for someone nice thank you okay. thank you okay so let me just let's let's walk on up here yeah. come on up come yeah, on i'm up. with that i'm with that i'm with that i'm with that <laughs> yes ma'am yes ma'am all right any final questions between either one of you before we move forward what is your type for the entire row i just want to do you have a type or is everyone your type? No, definitely not everyone. Um, you know, I grew up in a like predominantly like my my father and my mother, and they are both just black. Mm -hmm. So just beautiful black woman. You know what I mean? Like someone that just loves me for me, you know, like I wanna like keep mm -hmm. the the bloodline just like good, you know what I mean? Like strong. Exactly. <laughs> like black is black, you know what mm -hmm. I mean? And yeah, it's just as really as simple as that. Like I've just seen good, beautiful black love, and that's what I want. It's just as you should. beautiful black as you love. Should. You know what I mean? Where would you take someone on your like? Not you, someone you. Sorry, you. You're you. Right. Sorry, you're right. I'm yeah, sorry. You. I apologize. Yeah, where are we going on our first day? Yeah, yes. yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. So I'm like big on like I kind of like um like for a first date I'm really big on like the picnic kind of setup. I know it's a little hot for that, but we can do like an afternoon to the like to the sunset kind of like mm -hmm. picnic date. Mm -hmm. You feel me? Yep, yep, you yep. know what I'm saying? With just like the the sandwiches, the 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 grapes, the water, the the blanket. You feel me? Just enjoying the scenery, enjoying each other's out. company. Strawberry. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> like, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? So. Sheesh. Like, I'm just a lover boy at the end of the day. So, definitely just looking for Take love. Take my balloon. You can have it. Thank you. Oh, Thank you. okay. All right. All right. Like let, me, let me ask my little final question. Like so, is that. it a yes for you for him? It's a yes. I like him. Yes. But is it a yes for you for her? Definitely. We got a match. <laughs> okay, I'll definitely. take this mic. And y'all can go on up. Oh. All right, first of all, I'm going to point out a few positives about this dude, right? So, number one, he's respectful. There's nothing wrong with that. And on top of that, he's got good vocabulary and a little articulate in the way he speaks. Number two, I'd say he's somewhat bold and confident in his self-image. Oh, he also found a match. I'll give him that. But the problem with this dude is that he's simply just a dude. He walks like a dude, he dresses like a dude, he dates like a dude. I mean, if you see him walking down the street, you'd be like, oh, hey, look at that dude over there. Like, there's nothing about his appearance that says, I'm a man. That is why as soon as he walked in the room, every girl started popping their balloon. Before they could even listen to what he had to say, they didn't want nothing to do with him. I promise you that. 
um also i want to talk about his fit and he kept saying that oh this is what i feel comfortable under you know this is me this that and third yeah i i hear you but let's keep it a buck here man to increase your value you need to become someone else you need to become someone else you need to learn some skills you need to make adjustments and change your approach you can't play the game without training it's like me going for a business meeting or a job interview without preparing and say oh yeah when i get there i'm just gonna be me bro i mean come on man what you think is gonna happen also one other thing i noticed that these girls kept saying stuff like oh but you cute though they saying that because they don't want to hurt his feelings they don't want to break his heart and one of the girls kept it real and told him that she don't want him because he's soft and that she might dominate him another thing also i want to point out is that he ain't got a type He's he's out here um, complimenting all these girls, saying that he would date them all, you know, just that and third. But what he should be doing is picking and choosing. You, I mean, come on, you're alone in a room with eight girls and you fail to see that you're the prize? Oh, come on, man, stop it. You guys are... But anyway, this is a two-part series, so that's it for this video as part one. Now, go ahead and click the video at the top of the screen to watch the high-value man video in this episode. And don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, hit that bell notification, and I'll see you in the next video.